She's our bride. She's tiny, two short parts, two people. I was told there was a banker and a diner. That's all they told me. Hey, hey. Hey. Hello. How are you? Good, how are you? Yes. She seemed like a hugger, so I went for her. You must be the mayor. I am. Have you seen? must be the banker. Yeah. All right. Me between a mayor and a banker. What are the odds? I'm assuming you got coffee. You want steamer or milk? Milk's fine. As long as you don't make fun of me. What's this place called? J and W Grill. How long has this grill been here? 1957. 1957. Most people are raised in here. This is like Cheers without the beer. It is. Yeah. It is. Right? Yeah. I'm assuming everybody knows everybody. Mm, pretty much. I got so many questions. I don't even know where to start. All right. Wait a minute. What's up with the onion burger? Yeah. There it is. It's not yeah. a small. I'll take a small one. Okay. You want a small fry? Or a short short? What's a short short? It's a smaller basket. It's not like a big can full of fries. Sure. Is that the medium or is that the full on? This is just a regular short. That's a regular short? That's a regular short. Let me see that for a second. If you're keeping track, that's a regular short. Just saying. One thing I've noticed about you, Mike, you don't hold a job very long. Do I don't. <laughs> I don't. I had 350 on that one show for a day. <laughs> What's your population here? That's 17,000. For Chickasaw? For Chickasaw. Chick that's Native American, obviously. Yep. What's the personality of the town? What, uh, what defines the people here, aside from energy? It's an agricultural town. The uh, cattle and wheat, that is more visible really than the oil industry, other than what you see going up and down the road. And I love watching all these big configurations of oil field service trucks, wondering what the world is that thing doing. But the people here, I think, are just genuinely friendly, lovely people. It's like coming in here, who are sitting next to you, and you're talking. You know them. Oh, yeah. yeah. All right, so 17,000 people here, by and large, every one of them is either impacted by agriculture or energy. Oh, oh yeah, definitely. You really can't have one without the other, can you? I mean, when you think about modern agriculture, then that is, that's oil and natural gas. It just seems like your two main things, agriculture and energy, are the two things that our country is probably the most disconnected from right now. Yeah, I believe that. Do you like some more coffee? I'll take a warmer.